Aren't we lucky, right? Yeah. And I'm sure other teams love to play here as well. Yeah, we've <laughs> Why not? a nice stretch of weather coming up. Uh, we sure do. I mean, this time of year, it could be brutal. And yeah. instead, a little warm inland in the valleys today, but getting even cooler over the next few days. Beautiful. Yeah, <laughs> right, some we good news it. all around. Uh, so hopefully you enjoyed the nice sunny skies out there today. Temperatures running just a few degrees below average, and we've got even cooler weather in that extended forecast. So let's take you live outside to the beach. Why don't we? We've had beautiful beach weather and that is going to continue. We've barely seen that marine layer and in fact we've had mostly clear skies all across the south and from the beaches inland today unlike yesterday. Uh, so you can still see there's still some folks out there this evening although temperatures are slowly starting to cool down after a comf comfortable day today where we had a high of 83 degrees downtown. 85 is our normal high this time of year and looking at our current temperature still into the 90s inland besides Riverside that's now cooled down to 89 degrees at 77 downtown. Van Nuys at 88, 94 in Lancaster. But look at the coast. Oxnard already cooling down into the 60s. We've got an onshore flow, a southwesterly wind, a little gusty there in the Antelope Valley, the Apple Lucerne Valleys, and also inland where we've got wind sustained right around 16 miles an hour there in Riverside. Other than that, again, mostly clear skies at Marine there, well offshore, and we won't see much of it, that is for sure. And in fact, yesterday in our eastern portions of San Bernardino County, to Kern County. Uh, we definitely saw some showers and thunderstorms. Most of that moisture staying well out of our area today. That is that monsoonal moisture that can pop up this time of year, but again, not in our area. So just quiet conditions as this ridge of high pressure moves off to our south and west. And the reason our temperatures will cool down even a few more degrees, uh, take a look at this. This trough of low pressure still just to our north and east. Uh, so this ridge of high pressure just off the coast, and then we've got this trough of low pressure to our north and east. So we're right in between that. That's why it's so mild out there. Eventually, this high will build back in by next work week, and that is when we will have yet another warm up. So get ready for that. In the meantime, for tonight, we are looking at mostly clear skies, overnight lows into the mid 60s. Uh, your extended forecast keeping temperatures very comfortable, mid 70s if you're in along the coast. And again, temperatures just a tad cooler by the weekend. But look at the LA and OC metro areas. 83 tomorrow, 82 by Thursday. But by Friday into Saturday, LA and OC metro areas only into the upper 70s. So it doesn't get much more comfortable than that for August. 82 by Sunday, mid 80s Monday into Tuesday. Inland and the valley's warmest spots tomorrow will be into the low 90s. Uh, but Friday and Saturday, warmest inland and valley locations, guys only into the 80s, so that's Ooh. just unreal. Um, it's going to warm up soon enough by next week. Take a look at Tuesday, 98. <laughs> so, oh, there it goes. Just yeah. like that little reprieve, huh? Exactly. So let's just enjoy it for now. Yeah. Soak it in. Yes. All right. <laughs> Thank Thanks, you, Jackie. Jackie. Mm -hmm. well,